It's a stocky, sturdy, silky, smooth kind of dog with an ever-wagging tail. They are stunning to look at. There are a lot of people who would pay a lot of money to have hair like a Cocker Spaniel. Cocker Spaniels are sweet, loyal, affectionate, playful. In fact, they're terrible watchdogs because they're so friendly. Oprah Winfrey has three. President Truman had Feller. President Nixon had Checkers. And this Cocker Spaniel helped sell suntan lotion. Two other Cockers are famous in England for sniffing out cancer at Amersham Hospital. History says these dogs date back to the 14th century and originated in Spain. They may have been one of the few dogs to come to America on the Mayflower. Cocker Spaniels were bred to hunt game birds, particularly one game bird called the Woodcock is where their name comes from, the Cocker Spaniel. Way back then, a litter of Cockers weren't just all baby Cockers. The smaller dogs were called the Cockers and the larger ones were called the Springers. The smaller dogs were great at hunting woodcocks, birds that fly low to the ground. And the taller littermates were good at flushing or springing the flying game out of its hiding spots. The first lovable thing people notice are the Cocker Spaniel's long, low-slung, feathered, floppy ears. They're long and cute and flowy. Traditionally, Cocker Spaniels have dark eyes. They are round with almond-shaped rims. When they look at you, you really think they can understand what you're saying and they can look into your soul. The Cocker Spaniel's body is sturdy and compact. It's the smallest of the sporting dog breeds and the smallest of the Spaniels. Traditionally, these dogs live around 12 to 15 years, if properly taken care of. Good care on the part of pet parents is probably one of the things that is most likely to determine the length of a dog's life. Raise your dog in a stress-free environment. Apartment living works just fine. You just have to make sure you exercise them. Most cockers live fairly long lives, but see your vet often because they can develop cataracts, kneecap problems, and ear infections. You do need to pay regular attention to those ears, perhaps keeping the hair on the inside of the ear flap shaved down a bit to allow for ventilation. Along with keeping a cocker spaniel's ears clean, you will need to groom their body. And training can happen with a Cocker Spaniel, but they can be a little stubborn. If you don't train them well, they can develop a little bit of aggression. They can become a little territorial. So does the Cocker Spaniel make a good family pet? It can, but make sure you get yours from a good breeder. In general, the Cocker Spaniel can live almost anywhere, but needs exercise. They can have health problems like cataracts and ear infections. They need regular grooming and are easily trained. So overall, the Cocker Spaniel can make a good pet if adopted from a reputable breeder.